I'm gonna read the update and then we're gonna make a video. So here we go. We have a update and some information for cross out today just to keep you all up to date. This won't be long. Some of the weapons and models are having a rework. We believe they are taking the physical model of these items and they're gonna be giving them an update, which could be good, could be bad. We have no idea, but the speculation is that no one has a clue what's about to happen. If I read the text as follows, to quote, many of you already know that the physical models of certain weapons of the game might not correspond to their visual models. Ooh. As a result, the weapon with a physical model that is too big inevitably receives more damage in battle and the ability to cover them in armor is limited. Okay, on the contrary, yeah, 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 yeah. We have refined the physical models on all these weapons and now they correspond to the visuals. The full list of changed weapons. Rapier, Storm, Whirlwind, Cyclone, Vector, Sinus, Spectre, Aspect, Punisher, Cynthius, Prometheus, Helios. Ooh, that would be cool. Equalizer, Arbiter, Big Guns, Big Guns they are, Big Guns. Um, equalizer should be good. Equalizer was overdue. Overdue. Equalizer will be fun now. You can actually see a little bit more of this, hopefully, because it's such a fun weapon. Reaper, Aurora, Blockchain, Breaker, Piercer, Fidget, Imp. Okay, wonderful. Structural parts. Physical models, structural parts, which belong to passive melee weapons, have also been changed. Now the sharpness of the angles of physical models is not as distinctive. Passive melee parts. Basically, three changes will affect the so-called wedges, okay? The vehicles and design feature which allows you to pick the enemy up, depriving him of mobility to move around. Now, it should be more difficult to pull off such actions on the battlefield. Wow! Changes in the passive melee weapons shouldn't affect the vehicles of those players who use them for their intended purpose, to deal damage by ramming and protect their car from other players. Cool. So they, they're looking to make the damage, you know, the player can protect themselves, but hopefully without having to literally scoop another driver out of the battlefield, which is the most frustrating aspect of this game in some ways. It's so frustrating. So that's an update. Thank you. And I'm going to upload this video. If you want to hear more information on this and my opinions, you can watch me now. I'm live right now. Yeah, I'll see you then. Bye. End video. End video.